come and listen to prana. It will be uh, one hour of deeply immersive meditative experiences. My name is Sandi Bhagwati. I'm the composer of this piece Prana, which I composed during the pandemic for four trombones. It was played twice on Zoom. This is the first live performance. Um, for this concert, I composed a companion piece called Music of Breasts for four singers. And um, these two pieces together rest on the notion that prana, the breath of the musicians and the singers, determines the length of their phrases. Um, and that is very individual. And prana means breath in Hindi and in Sanskrit. And this is what the piece is based on. The audience is placed in a circle facing outwards towards the musicians that encircle them. And that means that as a listener, you are immersed totally in the sound. Um, it's not presented to you from outside. You are in the sound, the sound revolves around you, traverses you, and has a, this kind of immersive meditative effect that is the goal of this piece. The voices have developed their own songs from the score that I gave them. Uh, and the voices can sound like a Ukrainian folk song voice or like an opera singer or like uh, somebody whispering into your ear. It's a very variable use of the sound and they are layered with the trombone. So um, the trombone does similar things and it's, you can hear as a musician or as a, as a, you can hear as a listener how the same way of breathing articulates itself in a trombone or in a voice. The score of Prana is a compromisation score and it is made um, as an instruction for the musicians to develop their own parts. They can make choices, they can make decisions, they put things together in the way that they like them and create their own part, which you then perform. So it's a collaboration between me, who has written the recipe for this, and the musicians who perform. <laughs> 